in five, four, three, two, one. You're live. Hello, Launch Families. It is September and I am back with Jennifer to have another Launch Facebook Live. So, so excited to have Jennifer join us. Jennifer is our, our Director of HR and um, has been with us now for eight months and has um, some some wonderful information to share about the, the work that she has been able to contribute. But before Jennifer starts, um, I would like to just acknowledge that we're in September, start of a new year. We've had the opportunity to bring in new staff, to support more families, um, it, despite still being in the midst of a pandemic. Um, we have several celebrations this month that, that's happening with our, our community of children and families, as well as with our staff. And so um, the first, the, we had a communication that went out about the Jewish High Holy Days, including the start of the new year, which is Rosh Hashanah, and then Yom Kippur, which immediately, shortly follows after. And so we, we celebrate with our Jewish community the um, opportunity just to, to know that they are being included and um, welcomed into the work that we are doing at launch. Another celebration we have this month is Latinx or Hispanic Heritage Month. And we, uh, again, celebrate all of our staff and our children and families who are represented, represented in the Latinx and Hispanic community. And um, our children, our families, are having the opportunity to explore more about not only their heritage, but for those who, who uh, don't share the heritage to learn more about the, those who they are in community with. And, and that is always, always exciting. And so um, now I will go ahead and welcome Jennifer. Uh, I I have a couple of questions for you and you, you know, we have 15 minutes, so you'll have the opportunity to share. And then um, if there's, you know, any, anything that you want to, you know, close out with after you answer the questions, then you'll have some, a little bit of time for that. All right. Okay. Ready? Okay. <laughs> I, I think I am. Okay. <laughs> so, um, and, and a little bit about Jennifer. Jennifer joined us, I said eight months. Did you join us in Jan January or February? No, I actually oh, joined in March. In March? In oh March. my gosh. Oh my, see, I feel like I've been here for 10 years and it's only been <laughs> one. So <laughs> I, I guess I'm adding more time to you as well because you, you really did like hit the ground running, as they say. And and um, started thinking, you know, very strategically and across the organization about how you know our staff can can be better served at launch. And so it does feel like you've been here a lot longer, a lot longer. And then uh, Jennifer joined us from Hawaii, um, working with another nonprofit there. And so, so just so grateful that you came across the the water to. Um, I think I think we're are we called the mainland. What's what's the yeah, United States the, the mainland. <laughs> mainland and um, not the United States. I'm sorry, Washington called. Um, <laughs> you come across to the mainland and have joined us. And I thank you for for making making that move. So, um, so my first question I have is that since you've been here um, over the past several months, you've actually looked into several perks and benefits for our staff and, and have, have actually implemented some, some new um, approaches to making sure our staff have wellness and health and, and resources to them. Would you share a little bit more? Yeah, I'd be happy to. Um, hello, everyone. Very happy to be here. Um, what uh, we've implemented is um, Access Perks. So it's an app. You can um, download it on your phone. Or you can um, access it through the desktop. What it is, is it provides discounts to um, stores, restaurants. You can even access discounts to theme parks. So like if you and your family were going to do a family trip to um, California and go to Disneyland or Universal Studios or any of those theme parks, 
you could definitely look at access parks and um, see what kind of discounts are available. I would just actually just looking a few minutes ago <laughs> just to kind of see what they have. And I think there's um, they have like ten dollars off at like some restaurants, like if you wanted to um, go get a steak this evening, I think Outback Steakhouse has like a ten dollar discount on it or there's or if you wanted a pretzel, you're, there's some discounts for Auntie Anne's. Um, so th there's like a whole bunch of um, resources available and not um, just um, restaurants and theme parks, but they also do service. Um, so you can, if you need a tire fixed, um, I believe Jiffy Lube is a vendor <laughs> that you can actually get um, service done. Uh, so you, there's like a slew of um, providers and it doesn't have to be at Washington State. So like if you're traveling, you know, you can definitely access the app and see what's available in your area. And the mm -hmm. best part is, is like if you, um, it's accessible, um, it's not just a one-time use. You can like, so if you were, nearby and um, like if there was like an Auntie Anne's next to you, you can go there every single day and get the same discount um, every day that you go there. So there is no, um, there's no limit. So, and then they actually do, I believe have like some fitness programs too, you can get discounts on and um, very accessible. You do have to access through your launch email though. So, um, and then when you actually go into the website, you will see the launch branding on our page and it's um, very easy to use. And if you have any questions, you know, definitely reach out to, to me or to the team. Okay. Wow, that's that's amazing. That's amazing to have access to those resources. And and we we hear sometimes, you know, organizations saying, well, can we get a discount? Staff saying, can we get a discount from the organization? Not like you said, the gym or or um, some of those, you know, group spaces. And so, well, thank you for bringing those those perks to us. Well, speaking of benefits, we are coming up on our open enrollment period here in a few months. And I know you're you're in this the stage of working with our benefit administrator and identifying what will be available to staff this year. Um, what are you hoping hoping that staff will have access to? Oh, that's a great question, Angela. Um, I'm really hoping we can introduce some new benefits this year for 2022. We are looking at a flexible spending account. So what that means is you can actually set aside uh, pre-tax dollars like towards your, um, your pre prescription. So if you have regular prescription or if you have, um, you have to pay for childcare. So some of you may have um, children that are not eligible to participate in our child care just because we service preschoolers. You may have like a toddler at home and have to pay for child care somewhere else. Um, you could definitely set aside funds for that. Uh, and the great part is with an FSA, it actually lowers your taxable income. So you actually do uh, technically bring home more money in, in, in how it works. Um, we're looking at that, looking if there's any opportunities to provide um, a wellness program. We're also looking at wellness vendors to see what's out there. Um, hopefully that will also decrease deductibles for employees um, and, and provide, you know, that great incentive for us all to be healthy and uh, just to take care of ourselves. Um, uh, but yes, looking at how we can help our employees with their medical and health needs and how we can do that in an affordable way for them. All right. Right. And you just rolled out the 401k yes. transition to a, a new provider that provides some additional benefits. Yes. Can you share a little bit about, about that? Definitely. So we do have a new 401k provider. It's with Principal. And the great thing about them is on their platform, on their website, they do have some um, other services. It's called Principal milestones. So what it is, is they have like a budgeting app that so you can actually go in and learn how to budget or, or help you with your finances. Um, the way they post it is if you have like, um, if you were wondering about saving for like a house or wondering how you can like budget or pay for your student loans, um, that that app can help you with that. Um, they also have a really neat like um, legal service as well as part of their milestones group. So like if you needed to do like a simple will or, or to help with um, 
some sort of directive, they can actually um, assist you in um, creating that too. So, um, and this is all inclusive. It's all part of what's available to us as employees of launch. So um, I would encourage any employee that's currently participating in your 401k to actually go in and look at those milestones. So I think it would be very helpful for, your, for, for all of us. Wow. Wow, wonderful. So um, another question I have is that, you know, as we as we think about our employee engagement, right, it's it's always helpful to think from from recruitment all the way through to retaining our staff. And so um, what is it that the HR department is doing to meet that need at, at launch? Yeah, so we've been um, really um working to partner with the hiring managers, um, really looking to see um, what, what their needs are for the program, and, and also looking to see how we can attract um, candidates. Um, we all know it's a really tough market out there. Everybody's looking for candidates. So, you know, we have a great employee referral program. I would encourage all of our employees to take, um, to make use of that. Um, you know, you do, um, you can receive up to $500 to, um, to refer somebody if they get hired. So 500 we, for full we time, we, we've actually have had staff take advantage of it. So, um, and it's always like the best way to get people because, you know, you know, you know, your coworkers, who your co coworkers are going to be, um, mm -hmm. the people that you refer tend to be more invested in, um, the organization. Um, so it's. It's really it's it's a wonderful program, and anybody who knows any a friend um, that's looking for work, we're hiring, and you know you do get that um, a referral incentive. And uh, right now, through the end of September, which will be ending soon, we do have a hiring incentive too. I mean, so if they stay within six months, we actually have a um, a reward for that too. Okay. Okay. And and we've had some staff. We have, we, we've been, yes, every, every pay period, we've been actually awarding somebody for a referral. So it, it's okay. been, it's been really great. Wow. That, that, that is really awesome. So any, anything else you want to share that's new with HR? Uh, you know, we have a new team member, so, you know, help with our recruitment and the onboarding process. Uh, so we can actually uh, focus on that service and the partnership we have with our managers and employees. Um, I do want to thank all the employees at launch. I mean, working through the pandemic and for everything that you do, um, you know, we want to be here to support you and, and how we can make this organization um, you know, a career of choice and, and just to be here for you and make sure that you feel supported and recognized for all your great work. Mm -hmm. Oh, another re great resource that, <laughs> that is coming out of the HR department is the newsletter, the monthly newsletter. Yeah. I have enjoyed reading <laughs> that monthly newsletter and, and um, seeing, the, you know, right now, I don't have the opportunity to get to all of the sites as regularly as I, I would love to and, and meet new staff as they're coming into the organization. But now through your monthly newsletter, you actually highlight new staff and show their picture and and tell a little, little something about them. And then even staff who um, have like returned or promoted. And, and then there's, there's always some um, really helpful information. And if staff actually read it and they can put their, their name in for a drawing for a raffle prize. Yes, we do have like a little uh, a pulse survey question uh, embedded into the newsletter. So we do want your feedback and you are eligible for a, a drawing for a prize. We, we did announce our August winner. Uh, so I, I would encourage everyone to um, read the newsletter, get great information and, uh, and you know, and um, get your name in for the drawing. We do have some really great prizes coming up. Wow. Well, thank you so much, Jen, for joining me and for sharing all that great information. And if anyone needs additional information or has a question about anything that was shared, please feel free to, to reach out and, and um, you'll get a very quick follow up and very thorough answer. <laughs> <laughs> so appreciate you. Enjoy the rest of your Tuesday and 
I will see everyone back here on Facebook Live in October. Great. Thank you. Bye. Thank Bye. you.